Good morning, everyone. This is episode one. Themes. Themes. I'm trying to keep these episodes thematic, like conversationally thematic. So like whether that's a theme that I come up with myself or if it's something that somebody else comes up with. It's a theme. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Bad question to ask, bro. Thursday's the theme. For three days? Thirsty three days, starting from Thursday. Cool. Thirsty three days, starting from today, Thursday. As much as I'd like the theme to be Thirsty Thursday for the next three days, the theme is actually gonna be why. Why I'm making content, why I've started doing this sort of content, and how my normal form of content is going to be affected. Those lasers are right in my fucking face. Working myself back through those questions, how's it gonna affect my usual form of content? If you've been around for the last couple of months, you may have known that I've been way, 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 on the back burner with the stream. It's just not on my priority anymore and I don't really, I don't feel as obligated to keep up with it anymore. What I do feel obligated to, the people that are interested in it, the people that have followed me for nearly four years because of Minecraft or because of whatever game that I was playing at the time. Minecraft and streaming will still happen, although it won't be every day. It won't be every day. Nowhere near every day. Not even every second day. Like, I don't know how often I will stream. Because although streaming has been really fun, it has not been really advantageous to me. And because of a compounding lack of interest, both viewer side and streamer side to continue streaming and other things like my mental health. Running a bit late this morning, sorry bro, I had to drop Kelly down to Brisbane to I'm on my way back from Brisbane and of course I forgot my fucking shop case, I'm flying home. I'm just trying to do stupid videos and I broke my fucking phone. I dropped it on the bench. That's so annoying. I'm sorry the perspective's all <laughs> fucked on this clip, but uh, I had to include it. Real quick to grab my shit and my shop K and I'll be in, but I should be there around 9.30. Just wanted to give you a heads up. Bro. Which leads us to the second question. Why this form of content? Because it's more fun. Because it's more interesting. Because I'm not interesting 100% of the time. Because I can edit a video to make myself seem more interesting. I don't know. It gives me the opportunity to include everybody in my bullshit and get to familiarize yourself with the other artists that are here, guest artists, and the processes of tattooing. So this particular client we've had in the seat with Tish this morning to get a, was it a touch up? And a, a bit of a rework. Yeah, changed the A bit of a rework on the crown and I'm just gonna add some script to the top of it. It's still gonna be very self-serving. It's very much the gist though. Unless people wanna film themselves, but this is my show. It is your show. It is your show. Yeah. And because I have the ability to take it wherever the fuck I want and not be strictly confined to a room for three to four hours a day playing video games or desk scrolling for the same amount of time trying to figure out what's funny enough to post as a meme. A lot of the times, what's funny enough for me is not funny enough for the memes. So this seems to be the logical step for me. And I've always wanted to do it. It's always been something I've wanted to... Look at these hairbrushes that I get from my dog. You can't eat him. He's funny though. Thank you. Excuse me. Uh, yeah, it's always been something I've wanted to do, but I've just been too shy to do it. But now I don't care. Which brings us to the next question. So this is a story of a guy where everyone's first impression that he's kind of chill, but when they get to know him, you find out he's chronically online. I'm just a pig man cunt with a little bit of time! I hope someone finds that funny and it's not offensive to the original creator. I forgot to film at work today because I had a no-show this morning and a bit of a mess around this afternoon, but that's okay. Why I make content? I make content for myself. First time I got a phone with a camera on it, I was been trying to make videos with my friends. Videos of my friends with my friends. And it was just a fun thing for us to do and share with each other. It's pretty much the only reason why I still do it today, why I started streaming because I just wanted to play games for my friends and hang out with my friends. But the form of content, Twitch as a platform just isn't fun. It's not the kind of place for people like me. Awesome, handsome, daring, devilish. 
smart, infinitely wise, talented. I honestly, I don't think I missed any points. At this stage, I think I've covered pretty much everything. Why, 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 why? If there's any other questions, ask them. So at the end of these videos, I'm going to be answering questions or uh, responding to some comments on the previous video. So because the last video was only an intro to this new series, I only got one comment and it was from Mini Jif, who's my brother. And he says, TBH, it's insane how you're manager and yet still you try to do so much for us and keep up the good work. No and yes, I'm not the manager. I'm not the manager. Jamie is the manager of the business. I am self-employed. But yeah, even though I am my own boss and I am busy all the time and trying to keep myself working and making money, I will 100% always, always try to bring some content out for people who are waiting for it. That pretty much wraps it up, doesn't it? Episode one. Thank you for hanging out. It's good to see you. Be good, stay safe. Bye.